in today's NCAA 25 video, I'm going to be bringing you guys defense to stop jet sweeps, wildcat offense, and then how to put yourself in better position to shut down the pass. If you're new to the channel and you enjoy these type of tips that you can also find the exclusive versions on my Patreon down in the link in the description, make sure that you drop a thumbs up, hit that red subscribe button. Number one key is to set your depth chart. This is going to have you set up for success as far as somebody that runs the ball heavy and only passes the ball when you force them to. To do that, you have to establish run defense, jet sweeps, speed options, all that in this defensive breakdown is going to have you set up for success. So set your depth chart, your halfback, your wide receivers, who you want at slot. The strengths and weaknesses of every team that you use is super important in this game. You can't press with 90 speed corners. You need fast corners. If you don't have fast corners, play off 6 to 7 yards. The defense is double mug. 90% of defensive playbooks have this and you want to establish the game with a cover 3. Now, if you are on the hash mark, video games is based off a of hash mark for one play touchdowns. Make sure that you crash your line outside. Early, first down, second down, crash your line outside, get them angles, and as you can see, jet sweep defense with this mug is great. You're either going to get a defensive tackle free, easy, or you're going to have good outside containments because the align is going to originally look for the people in front of them. Now right here, I'm going to double Mabel the wide side. We have a blue on the end and the purple on the linebacker that's gonna help me get contained to the edge all you have to do is with your user rally to the ball this brings up a third and 16 we have showed him that we can stop the run 25 yard blues I'm gonna come out and cover two invert now I'm gonna Shade down, shade over the top. I want 25 yard blues on both sides of the field because I want to stop corner routes in those type of situations. So we have a blue to the right, a blue to the left. Let's see what my opponent does. He can't run the ball third and 16. We're going to watch the running back and he throws it to a blue right here. We're going to set up a one play bomb that you're going to be able to find this full offense in the patreon and i also have my ebook that's getting ready to go live this is a all zone beater cover two cover three cover four it don't matter one of the zones on the short side of the field will be manipulated and he will get open as long as you have the time in the pocket but this video is about defense i'm going to be bringing you guys tips every upload so pay attention right here he throws it to the seams okay we in the cover three shield. The seams are the weakness. Guess what? With two linebackers mugging the gap, you can use them as cross man. So we're going to take that read away and then we're going to see what he does. Loop around pressure from the defense. Nothing special. Boom. That puts him at a second and 19. You're going to get pressure occasionally. I also have an easy A gap blitz that I already uploaded on my Patreon. Now we're going to take away the tight end. In that slot receiver, not clicking the controller, and what is he going to do? He's going to try to force the read because everybody is playing their zones, and we get an interception because we are stopping the run, and now when he has to pass the ball, which he doesn't want to do, we are stopping the pass. Let's go.